Okay, we are still working on 3.5, okay? Uh, but this is part two, we're talking about loans, right? Uh, in American life, most of us will at least have some loan, such as like student loan, um, car loan, or, you know, mortgage loan, right? So um, let's talk about it. First, uh, today, I would like to introduce about the loan formulas that we're going to use uh, is P equal to L times one minus one plus IOM raised to the power negative MT. Okay, and I want everything divided by R over M there. Okay, so it's have to be really watch out and maybe, you know, especially with calculators. Mostly from this session, uh, you have to really watch out by using calculator and, 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 and please follow me carefully, okay? Okay, now, um, first in this, in this session, we have T, as same as before, which is, um, which is a balance in the count at the beginning, which is starting amounts or principle, right? L is gonna be the loan payment, like is that by monthly payment or annually payment, right? And R in years uh, stay as annual interest rate in decimal decimal form. Um, M stay as number of compound periods in the years, and K minus in from in 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 loans is always always uh, will be the same as um, um, and how you uh, uh, how often of the loan payment yes. a number uh, how often? I want to say the number of time, the number of times, uh, yeah. I would say always, um, always, okay, so maybe just my word, I would say. Same as um, the way we are doing in loan payment, right? Like how many payment in a year? How many? How many? How many payment in a year? Or how many? The number of payments in a year, right? number of payment in a year. Okay. So T is the length of the loan in year. So Okay, now let's start with an example 3.26 with care loan with in Five year. So that means T equal to five right away, right? What else do I have? Um, suppose that you can afford $500 per month. So that means uh, that mean L is the, the loan payment, the amount of loan payments. Um, 
you will pay is five hundred. Right, five hundred. And 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 because let me highlight it. And because you say a month, you pay that. That means I can right away say M is 12. Payment, uh, monthly payment. Monthly payment, all right. Uh, oh, total time payment in a year, something like that. All right. And R in here will be 6%, which is 0 0.06. All right. Let us highlight it. And how expensive a car can you afford? So we use how much you can afford for uh, for a car, right? So, what is amount of loan you can afford? All right, so let's substitute everything in here, right? So we have L is five hundred. Time with parentheses one minus one a parenthesis here plus r was zero point zero six divided by m which is twelve. All right, and then raised to power, I put negative mt so negative twelve. Time with Five. Okay, and then close the parenthesis. And everything's I divided by R over M, which is 0 0.06 divided by 12. Okay, I mean, if you really like to simplify, you can. Okay, you can just simplify, but sometimes it's not going to be a nice number. So I will recommend, I will recommend do everything in once. Okay, but I mean, let's let me show you for step by step first, right? So let's simplify. Say, find us stay there. Uh, time with one minus okay, so one plus zero point zero six divided by twelve, right? So I'm gonna just use the calculator. So I'll say one, one plus zero point zero six divided by twelve. Okay, what is that equal to? Uh -oh. One plus zero point zero six divided by twelve. Okay, so I have one point zero zero five, right? One point zero zero five. Okay, and then negative twelve times five, I'm gonna have negative sixty on the power. And I go this. And I divide it by 0 0.06 divided by 12 will be equal to 0 0.05. But if you like, check with calculators, go ahead and do that. 0 0.06 divided by 12 will be equal to 0 0.05. Right. Sure, I got. 
but you might be good. And now you will do 500 time with parentheses one minus parentheses 1.005. So that's raised to power. Okay, watch out at this step, right? Negative 60. So put parentheses for the negative. 60. All right, go that. And then close one more time for the big policy here, right? And then I divide by 0 0.005. So I get 25,862. So I'm gonna say 25,862. Um, point seventy eight. Say that. So that mean, uh, I will say the car that I can afford. What is going to be about like twenty six thousand, maybe, right? Um. So let's say. Yeah, let's see. Okay, so this is a way by step by step to have the answer. However, like I told you before, sometimes it's going to be not a good number, right? Not a nice number. Sometimes you have like 0 0.05 and divided by 12, maybe that's right, 0 0.05 divided by 12. Right. You can see it's going to be a, not a nice number like, you know, 0, 0, 6 divided by 12, right? So you don't want to do like this anymore. What you do is put everything in once and do it. Okay, let me show you. All right, watch out here, yeah, okay? So see, see right now I'm having fineness. Everything's on the uh, power. I mean, on, on the top here, uh, it doesn't have any like, like subtraction things um, between finders and this guy here. So I I can just start with finders, okay? Because the, it's just multiplication here, actually, right? So you can start with finders. If you scale that, you can you can go ahead and put out policy for the whole top. That's okay too. So let's do that. Policy, finders, and then time with. All right, I do one more parenthesis here. I put one minus parenthesis one so plus. Okay, I'm 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 I I am using this guy. Okay, zero point zero six divided by twelve. Okay, close that parenthesis, and I put the power. Okay, I'm, I make sure I have the parentheses uh, negative 12, negative over here. Don't put subtraction, okay? Time five, go oh, that. Okay, so I'm, I'm here. I close the parentheses here, right? I close the big parentheses for this, this group here. And then I close the one more parentheses for the whole numerators. And I divide by the bottom with is denominator. So with parenthesis, 0 0.06 divided by 12. Close that. Enter. And you have exactly what I'm having here. Okay. So this is this kind this kind of problems really need you to practice well before the exam, okay, with using calculators. Okay, so please practice, practice, okay? Now, let's move that now. Go ahead and try this exercise, okay? Um, we can highlight some things such as like, uh, 
do you want to adjust L, the loan amount, what you pay each month? What about if the interest rate come down a bit? How much uh, a difference will that make? Make at least one change to the number above and be ready to report out. So let's say, uh, let's say you may chain L go here, right? You can afford, you know, 600 a month and see, try to see if, uh, if how much for for a car, for instance, that's right. Or even I uh, put you know, like thousands, uh, something like that. Or um, maybe you want to instead of like worrying about um, five year, I want to do it, it in just two years. So chain T maybe. Okay, so go ahead and try to play with that thing. Okay, but don't. Don't change P because we are looking for P. All right. Okay. So uh, I'm going to skip this one because this one is kind of like very various with each other. Right. So I'm going to move down to example 3.27. Okay. You plan on taking out any 600,000 mortgage. Um, the interest rate on a 30 years fixed loan is 7.3%. So how much will your monthly payment be? Okay, now uh, it's talking about the mortgage loan, right? Okay, and the interest rate right now is 7.3%. And the time you will use is 30 years usually and keep in mind that usually for mortgage loan you will have monthly payment right so you will have l uh don't know right you, you want to know how much monthly um you want to buy 600,000 um, for like a house with 600,000, right? Um, and no, actually not, not a house with 600,000, maybe uh, the house with 700,000 and you, you down is uh, 100,000, something like that. For example, right, the rate is seven point three percent, which is zero point zero seven three in decimal, right? This the M, which is twelve, because you pay payment monthly, right? Monthly payment, so. And then T will be 30 because we're gonna do, someone maybe do 15, but in here we do 30 years, right? Okay, so just gonna using the same formulas as before, okay? Um, but we're gonna substitute, okay? So P equal to, L times one minus one plus R over M raised to the power negative MT. Go that everything divided by R over M. All right. Last thing out. So P in here is six hundred thousand equal to L, we don't know, 
term with one minus one here, one plus zero point zero seven three divided by twelve raised to power negative twelve times with thirty. And I would like to make this in a parenthesis to make sure I don't mess up with that. All right. And then I go that big pregnancy here and I divide by 0 0.073 over 12. All right. So let's calculate that. So we have uh we're gonna have okay, so let me see for this k so in this k i have to do two things Okay, I will have to calculate the one, uh, this one over here, All right? I will calculate that. And the one below here, okay? And then, and then see what I have. So I'm gonna have, one minus four parentheses one plus zero point zero seventy three divided by twelve for that raised power parentheses negative twelve times thirty. Okay, now you see, I have like a, a, a bunch of number of things that's, you know, um, that's, we don't really like it. Okay, so in this case, what you do is, uh, you may have to write out as many as you can for the number to make it accurate. Um, so, at least you may have to write as, you know, um, six decimal place, okay, maybe. So then, uh, so then it will be uh, more accurate. Like the more you write, the more accurate you have in the last. Okay, so let's say we will have, uh, we will have, Zero point. So let's write here six thousand six hundred thousand equal to L times one minus. Uh oh, I need to calculate this one already. Time with zero point eight eight seven. Three, three, eight. Okay, I, I am using the six decimal place. Okay, and then I divide by. Yeah, so zero point zero seventy three. I divide by twelve. Because zero point zero zero six zero eight zero point zero zero six zero eight three right so down here I also using a um 
took that to my place. And now I will have, we'll use uh, 0 0.887338 here. I divide by 0 0.006083 and I will get uh, 600,000 equal to L times uh, 145. Point eighty seven one seven seven one forty five point eighty seven one seven one seven seven three eight. Okay, one more sure. All right. Okay, so lastly, I will. Divide both sides, right? Divide both sides, 600,000, right? Both sides by 145. What? 871777738. Okay. And we'll get. Numbers thousand divided by one four five point eight seven one seven seven three eight and that's give us S four one one three point forty three. Let me make sure. Oh, ready. So this this. Universe at four one one three point twenty cents. Okay. Well, it may still have some, like you know, some arrows since we route early route at six decimal place there. Okay. Let's say if you do as. Uh, one minus minus e one um, plus zero point zero zero seventy three divided by twelve. So that's and raised forward minus e negative twelve. Time thirty. Right, let's see that. Enter that. Um. Uh oh. I made some small mistakes somewhere. Let's see. Um. Yeah, a small mistake at zero here. Got to do it again. Zero point zero seventy three divided by twelve. So that's raised power negative twelve um thirty. So that enter. 
Okay, so as you see now, I will have this amount. And I get, I want to divide by parentheses 0 0.073 divided by 12. Close that. And I will have. 145.86 something, All right? So, so, so like I told you, it still can make some minor mistake, like, you know, like an arrow, some arrow with sense, okay? Um, and this step here is, is supposed to be 86.38. Uh, turn it here, right? And you will do sixty hundred thousand divided by this guy, right? So if I using this number, say second memory, when I'm How can I remember this one? This one. Doesn't work. About. Okay, so I'm trying to have that number, but look like we don't have it. So we can just put out all 600,000 divided by 145.863828. And then enter. Now you will get you will get even a better correct one was up to forty three. So forty three. So I would like to to just when I use calculators and get from here right away to this step and using 145.86382 okay so you may have to Practice with calculator to to have this six three eight two okay. So let me show one more time. Instead of doing by part, you're doing all the green one in once. Say parentheses one minus. Parentheses one plus zero point zero seven three divided by twelve. Close that parentheses raised to power parentheses negative power times with thirty. Close that. Okay, close this here, right? And close that parentheses here. And then I divide it by, and now at the bottom, I make the parentheses 0 0.073. I divide by 12. Close that. Then 145.863828. Uh, 
is three two. I'm missing the eight here, right? Missing the eight here. And then I try using this number. Um, do, uh, do, uh, uh, using singular thousand divided by that one, right? To get the amount. Four one one three point forty three. Okay. Uh, let me try this way and see if we can have that. If I write six hundred thousand, okay. Um, Raise power negative one. We're gonna make us to flip it. Okay, so that is a uh, good, really good um, answer. Sorry, that's the answer gonna be wrapped to 43. Okay, good. All right, so we did have the answer for this one is 4113.43. So I would like to let you guys practice on exercise 3.32 here. And we are working on L, okay? Um, I will, sh I will go ahead and give you the answer key, okay? So for this one, I'll be 146.89. Yep, try that. And this one, there are 24 months in two years. Multiply her monthly payment by 24 to see how much she is paying in totals. So you want us to like 146.89, you multiply it by 24. What is that gonna be? Go ahead and try, right? Okay, so I have finished session 3.5. We're gonna see you in the next session. Have a good day.